Now we come to the most fun part of the segment, okay? And after stressing me out for so long, my my team has prepared a whole bunch of things on this. I add. Is it one. like a rapid fire? From yeah, it's Karan called it's called, it's called li- it's called live. No, don't don't don't, <laughs> don't mention <laughs> anybody. Don't Karan. mention anybody. There's there's no inspiration around it. Uh, this is more about it's called live bow shots. And again, it is rapid fire, but it's more fun rapid fire. I have actually added one basis something very interesting you spoke in the earlier part of our chat. So these are the ones where you don't use your brain, Smriti. which is very oh, difficult tough. for you yeah which is very difficult for you i appreciate yeah. that uh, knowing <laughs> the kind of person that you are yeah. but at times eh, you have to give your heart a chance also we'll try yeah so this is the ones where you have to give your heart a chance and answer from your heart shall we i will try yes shall we and i can say cut right yeah you can always say cut but this is a podcast <laughs> yeah you know at the end of the day live doesn't give you a retake why should the podcast give yeah. but go ahead um book a phone now phone Whiskey or gin? Gin. Beach or mountains? Beach. Dosa or paratha? Dosa any day. What's your go-to comfort food? If you had to eat one food for the rest of your life, let's say a situation arises and you have to eat one dish for the rest of your life, what would it be? That will be a khara bath from MTR. Mm. Okay. What's the most wicked thing that you have ever done? Oh, that's yes. a tough one. Several. The most. I would think. Let's say let's let's make it scandalous. What is the most <laughs> wicked thing that you've done? You know, let's shatter that perfect image of yours. And uh, let's say that Smriti is also human. So, what's the most wicked thing that you've done? I can't think of anything right now immediately which I can actually talk about. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'll switch it. What's the most adventurous thing that you've done? Most adventurous for me. uh would be parasailing i would think that's adventurous easy. yeah okay if you could go and meet and go on a date with a celebrity mm-hmm. and that could be any field knowing you you will always find a very random celebrity to come in maybe some i won't say random because people will say that you know random has its own dip- definition but i'm saying celebrity typically is always looked at from a movie star I know perspective it is. but in your case who would it be shahrukh khan So this you not surprise me. <laughs> Actually, this you surprise me. I mean, like any day. I would have expected something different, but yes, this shows you're human. Yes. What's your favorite movie quote? Movie quote. Yeah. And I want to link something to this, which I have written down, which uh, I I got inspired by a earlier part of what you spoke. But first, talk about this. What's your favorite movie quote? I can't think of anything. Sir, क्या बात कर रहे हो? शाहरुख़ खान है तो कुछ ना कुछ तो आ ही जाएगा. Of course, मतलब regular ones तो है ही। नहीं नहीं regular नहीं deep होना चाहिए। What is regular? No, I definitely। Okay, let's tell you regular Shahrukh Khan movie quote है। What is a regular? No, बड़े-बड़े देशों में is is an all time। That is right. Okay. For me, it works in all situations, good or bad. That is not Shahrukh Khan's quote. Hello. That is Kajol's quote. It's from his movie. It doesn't matter, but that is Kajol's quote. So the, you asked for movie quote. I can't. I can't believe I'm actually remembering who's quoting that. What are you saying? You. It's Shahrukh Khan who says, "Bade bade deshon mein se choti baat hai." Kajol says that. Kajol says that. Okay. If it's not, no. then you please cut because I don't know. I have no uh, movie knowledge around. But actually, I don't. Uh, yeah, I can't think of a movie line which like really. I think what you should have said is about that. Ki you know which is that one? Um, since you said Shahrukh Khan. Uh, बॉलीवुड बफ एंड यू गाइज वुड वॉच Every given movie over the weekend or any other. Hmm. Name one movie from which you have drawn inspiration in a manner, Oof. which has helped you today in your life the way it is. You don't watch movies to draw inspiration. I know, but at times, at times you don't. It is to release your no, brain. At times, what happens is you may unknowingly realize something, and it draws tremendous amount. Like I have a movie where I can say I have drawn incredible inspiration. That's my life motto. I'll give you a hint. I'll facilitate your thought. For me, my life's motto is driven from a movie called Rocky, where there is a whole construct about that it does not matter how hard you can hit. What matters is how hard you get hit, and in spite of that, can you get up 
and keep moving ahead so for me that's life and that's the biggest inspiration that i've drawn from that movie so it's not necessary that you yeah, put your thinking cap on i think i'll out. disappoint you on this because i don't think i have a movie which has inspired me on life because you predominantly watch bollywood yeah i'm a total bollywood buff then then i don't blame you too much ah uh, that's another prejudice there otherwise you'd have you, otherwise you got inspired no why 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 You can't get Bollywood. Just because Hollywood because Bollywood is not inspiration. Are you trying to say that? No, I'm saying that I don't watch movies to draw inspiration for my life. Yeah, whether it's Hollywood it's, or Bollywood, it's, it's natural. It should come naturally. You don't go and watch to draw. Ha, so it's like Govinda can't go across and inspire you <laughs> a Govinda movie. What he can inspire you is that no matter what the situation is, make a joke about it and yeah, be happy and about it. Yourself, so you draw. Well, I'm not that. I understand. Yeah. That's not a prejudice. But anyway, uh, what's that one indulgence you would love to partake in but no one knows about? Not your family members, not your inner circle, not your girl gang. No why will you about. know about it, or why will the podcast know because about that's, that's it? Because that's the that's the idea <laughs> of the podcast. Talk about things which people don't know about Smriti. That's the whole idea. That's what I told you as the brief at the very beginning <laughs> of the podcast. At the end, I you can't say, "Arey, yar, मतलब you heard the whole Ramayan and then you're like, Sita कौन थी? It doesn't work like that. No, that's true, but uh... talk about an indulgence which no one knows about. Could be anything. You don't have to be that wicked that you don't talk about. No, but that's the thing. I think uh, somebody or other will know if I'm indulging in something. I don't think there's anything which anybody doesn't know. You know what I mean? Like, no, I'm talking about that you would want to partake. You still not partake in it. So they would have known had you partake in it. Oh, like that. Like that. Indulgence. Dude, this is rapid fire. Yeah, it's not <laughs> happening clearly. Yeah. I can't think of anything very okay. honestly. You very boring. Very uh boring, let's go to no? let's go to the last question for the day. Hmm. This I'm sure you'll answer. If you get a if you could have had one superpower for a day, what would it be and why? One superpower for the day. Don't think. It's not coming that naturally for oh, me. Think. <laughs> you you ruin this entire rapid fire zone but think one superpower what would you want uh i would want the superpower to travel the world see every part of the world in one day yeah if possible <sighs> okay like teleportation in a way which a way all the one in one day you will see everything If I had the superpower, you are saying it. Right? Yeah, It's I mean, like, like the... even superpowers have the limitation. I mean, like, <laughs> yeah, now you can't put caveats there. No. In one day, you will see the whole world and see what is in it. What is in it? I don't know. I'm just saying. All right. What is the power, superpower you want me to? I don't want you. It was your thought. Think of. No, no. Think oh, of. Fair uh, enough. It would be because uh, I think travel for me is. I know. Is. Quite... You keep you you ensure that I feel jealous with your. uh ig updates and your pictures yeah. that you have that i, I don't know about that. but yeah so yeah, yeah yeah it's okay you have a good life countries, don't people. rub it in i understand you have a good life it's okay so before we end there's one last formality that you have to do and i i keep joking about this but actually i'm quite dead serious so the formality is that i'm using this as my retirement units so i have a whole bunch of super achievers like you all and uh, i'm hoping one day that because of the billions of dollars that you all will earn and become such big people your signatures will be worth a lot and that day i can auction all the like would uh mugs with your signatures because these will all become collectors items yeah and uh, make a whole lot of money out of it uh but okay, jokes, mumbi, shakar. but uh, jokes apart uh, the idea is that uh, please write some message this goes into our live vote uh, cupboard it's a memory it's a it's a it's a memento which stays for season 1 and uh, this is something which is very valuable for us as a whole team so please write something that you felt about this what you think about this and what you believe that this podcast can keep doing hopefully season after season too much to season. think again i know but think and write do you have to do it dosti ka kuch to wo hota hai na yaar kiya hai to nibhana padega uff see i even open the cap for you can't be sweeter than that Right, I'm waiting. What will you write and think? I don't know. I'm. Uh, this is too short a notice to think and write. I mean, like that's the idea. The idea is in this think and write. In the rapid fire, you are not supposed to think and answer. What have you written? Can you show it to me also? She's written a whole bunch of stuff. 
What? I can just sign. Yeah, of course. No, no. Love you only ask. Can you give it to me now? No. I have to show it to you. If you're gonna make fun of this. Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, beautiful. I made you reflect. Is it? Oh my <laughs> God. Thanks. So that's what it is, folks. That was Priti Chandra. Thank you so much for watching this episode. See you the next one. Signing off. Mm-hmm.